The Citroen's WW100 way feeder is designed for quick and easy belt change. Understanding the proper sequence ensures optimum accuracy and can reduce downtime. Like all Citroen's way feeders, the WW100 is cantilevered. There are no parts to be removed during a belt change. This makes belt change easy and it ensures that maintenance and quality are never compromised. Way feeders come in many sizes. Smaller units like the WW100 can have the belt changed by one person. Larger units may require two or more people. If the unit is enclosed, open the access panels to begin. To avoid damaging the load cell, we recommend using the shipping stop. Pay attention to the direction the belt moves. If not marked already on the belt, indicate the direction of travel. Some new belts come with directional arrows printed on the underside. Mark the location of the telescopers, then loosen the jam nut and retract the telescopers. Push the belt out of the side guide roller and lift the belt tensioner. We are now ready to remove the belt from the feeder. On other Citrans model way feeders, access supports or sealing strips may also need to be removed for belt changing. The WW300 way feeder also has optional gravimetric belt tensioning and tracking. This assembly can be removed or connected to the frame for easier maintenance or belt changing. Repeat these steps in reverse order to replace the belt. When reassembling, ensure that any belt seals are properly contacting the belt. You also want to make sure that the belt is riding in the guide rollers. Following the right sequence for a belt change on a way feeder ensures you will save time and optimize accuracy. And a Citroen's WW way feeder makes it so much easier to do.